the hands move uh, horizontally, not only vertically. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Bakugan unboxing video. Today we go back to all the way to Battle Planet. So here is Ventus Mentanoid Ultra. Mentanoid was mainly used by the Exit team, the one that consisted of the members A, B, C, D, and E. So uh, Ventus Mentanoid was uh, A's Bakugan, A A Y. How you spell it out? In Armor Alliance, A gave his Ventus Mentanoid to his brother Trey, and also Chad won an Aqua's version. Anyway, I'm not too sure about all these. I uh, can't really remember. But anyway, this is Mentanoid, one of the nicer Bakugan Ultras that we had in Battle Planet. This together with Garganoid were the nicer looking ones. Okay, so have a look at the front. Have a look at the back. So what's included is one character card, one ability card, two Baku cores, and of course the Ultra Bakugan Mentanoid. Have a look at the buckle in, in case you're interested. Okay, so we offer the do. Let's open this up. The instructions and checklist. Eight steps. Cool. Mm -hmm. And the rule book. Okay, the character card and the ability card. Ventus Mentanoid Ultra, Green Fist and Helix 601. Looking very dark actually. Printing is not very well done. And we have Razor Claws, 3 energy to use, plus 2 damage turbo if you have the most energy cards in play, plus 7 damage instead. Yeah, back in the day when we had the proper TCG, these cards were yeah, quite useful. Say this. And the two cores, Helix, minus 100B, plus 4 damage. And Green Fist, minus 3 damage. Okay, so Mentanoid, looking very complicated, too close. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be like this. Back legs. No, I don't see any manual parts. He came in a lot of uh, different factions in the show. The entire Exit team had Mentanoids. A had Ventus, B had Aquas, C had Darkus, D had Heos, and E had Pyrus. Yes. The only one that wasn't available was Aurelus because remember Aurelus was a rare faction and didn't appear so often. Yeah, so they only have five members. So as we know, this is the Ultra version. So there's uh, a, a core version for Mentanoid, which looks like this. This is the core version of the Ventus Mentanoid. So, so, together, they look like this. Ultra version, of course, looks much more realistic. But I feel the core version has a nicer appeal, for me at least. It looks so much cuter. Yeah, personally, I, I prefer the... Uh, core version looks nicer. This of course looks better in terms of realism, but I prefer the core version. Okay. So, uh, how do we close it? I think this is not that difficult. So a lot of these earlier modes had uh, all these protrusions, which some people didn't like call it the uh, Alto Brontes disease based on the original Alto Brontes in, uh, from Legacy. Yeah, he had a lot of protruding parts. Whether or not these are necessary or not, I'm, I'm not too sure, but I guess they are necessary for the design. Ah, it's opening up. Yeah. So, since this is an Ultra, let's use some cores. One, two, three, bro. Oh, maybe I need to fling a bit harder. Let's try again. One, two, three, bro. Okay. One, two, three, bro. Definitely no. One, two, three, bro. Yeah, I can't, I can't seem to get it to land top side up. But anyway, this is Ventus Mentanoid. The hands move uh, horizontally, not only vertically. Okay, so this is Ventus Mentanoid. So this has been the unboxing of Ventus Mentanoid Ultra from Battle Planet. What did we get from this set? We have this uh, character card, Mentanoid Ultra character card. We have this ability card, there is a clause, as well as the two buck cores. So this has been my unboxing video for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this content, please click the like button and subscribe. See you next video. Thanks. Bye.